I feel like time has been passing me by for a while. In high school, it was so easy to get caught up in schoolwork and boys and friend complications that you'd forget to soak everything in. I'd forget to pay extra attention to my baby sister's laugh or to really look at and memorize the dog I'd had since I was three. I read one of my favorite books, Tuesdays with Maury, when I was 17 and learned that wherever I am in life, I should soak in and let myself marinate in every emotion I'm feeling so I can release it and be light enough on my feet to go forward. You can't let yourself be weighed down with regrets or what-ifs because you'll just continue to make more of them by doing that. Every place you're seeing right now is a place that was deeply important to me when I was younger. Places I snuck out of the house to go to. Places I tried to buy cigarettes at when I was 16. Places I fell in love with boys and friends and all life had to offer me. Even though I've moved on from them and these places and moments are no longer at the center of my universe, I never ever want to forget about them. I never want to forget the girl I was when I was 15, 16, and 17 because she was beautiful and valuable and self-fulfilling even when she didn't know she was. Because she chose the most beautiful souls to become and remain friends with. Because she worked so hard in pursuit of her creative dreams and her independence. Because she drove around just to drive, blasting Taylor Swift in the town the two of them shared, fireworks in her eyes and heart and soul. Just another ten minutes past curfew, worth every second of trouble she got in to be in her favorite places, with her favorite people talking the sun out of the sky and the voices out of their throats. Here's to the calloused fingers from the songs they wrote, and the empty gas tanks from the fuel they couldn't afford. In a wide open cage, free throughout her entrapment. Liberty in the city of sailboats and cages. Mm -hmm.